Hi guys, my name is Helen and I'm here today to help you to write a short paragraph in English. We are going to speak about how to write an outline and then we'll discuss some examples. Are you ready? Let's do it! You need to start your writing not just with writing what you some ideas can be not in the right order, something comes into your mind, you are disorganized, disorganized, that's not good. We need to start any writing with an outline. What is it an outline? Firstly, you need to think about the topic you want to write about. For example, it can be food. Then you need to think about the controlling idea. There are so many things we can write about food. You can write about how it helps people in their life or how it causes problem to a lot of people. So think first that what will be your controlling idea and then put together your topic and your controlling idea. It should be the first sentence which is called a topic sentence and this sentence will tell the reader what are you going to write about. The next point is to give supporting sentences. It is easy to make them. Using my help here, you can write something about where it happens, maybe in what country some process is going on, when, maybe when people eat this food, why do they eat it, how often do they eat it. Well, it is important to give examples. So, if people eat it twice a year, you can tell that they eat it, for example, when the winter starts or when the summer starts, so on. Or why do they eat it? To celebrate something. And then, after you give some supporting sentences. Actually, they can be they can be four or four supporting sentences with maybe two examples. And believe me, it will be enough. And then you need to come to a concluding sentence. Your concluding sentence can um, give the reader the point that you have. Um, written about everything and looking at all the details, look at, looking at all the facts, you can say that it is a good idea, for example, to eat this food or it's a bad idea to eat this food. So, this is my example, guys. I want to speak about a traditional breakfast and my controlling idea will be in the USA. So I put them together in my first topic sentence. I have now. People in the United States like to start their morning with a special kind of breakfast. Then I will give supporting sentences. Some people have breakfast at any time of a day because they like this meal so much. They eat it during any season of the year. It can be in their house or at any cafe. Typically, it includes fried bacon, scrambled eggs and toast with cream cheese or jam. The majority of people prefer to have coffee with their breakfast. People who do not have many physical exercises during their day sometimes have a light breakfast, which is cereal, fruit and coffee. So, as you can see, I have given a lot of examples and 
my supporting sentences were about when do people when people eat it uh, why where how often and now it's time for me to come to the conclusion in conclusion no one will get hungry after an american breakfast that gives a lot of energy for the rest of the day that's all for now guys i hope this video was useful like it write your comments below and subscribe to my channel hope to see you next time bye